Hi, boys and girls. I know we're missing Judy clock that we do every day. So I went and found a clock in my basement, and let's just call her Judy Jr. I know she has no eyes and mouth, but it will work. And what I did is I took the glass off the top of it so then I can play with the hands of the clock. I will also give you a printable clock you could make at home if you don't have a clock at your house. So let's go ahead and try the first time. We'll start easy and get harder. We'll do 10 o'clock. So see if you can find 10 o'clock with your clock. Normally we'd say one, two, three, show me, but since I can't see you, I'll just go ahead and show you on our clock. So remember we start with our little hour hand first. So the little hour hand would go to the 10 and our big minute hand would go up to the 12. So there we go, 10 o'clock. Okay, let's get a little harder. Let's try 1.30. I hope you're not staying up till 1.30 in the morning since we don't have school. Find 1.30. Oh, how'd you do? How'd you do? So remember, we were a little before you're big, so little hand first. So that little hour hand is going to go between the one and the two. And our big minute hand goes down to the six. So there is one thirty. Even harder. I hope you remember this. How can I find 11.10? 11.10 is probably when you eat lunch. 11.10. 10. Don't fall for that trick. Don't fall for the trick. Don't put that on the 10. Go ahead and try it. Okay, so we have 11, 10. So do 11 first. Your little hour hand first would go to the 11. I hope you didn't fall for it and put your big minute hand over at the 10. Remember, get that up to the 12 and say, how do I get to the 10? Remember, we look at each Number on our cl clock, we count by fives. So ready? Five, ten. So there's eleven, ten. Remember we went five, ten. Whew, we made it. So now we're going to try our quarter after we do. So everyone, if you can on your clock, get your big minute hand up to the twelve. And just like we would be in school, repeat it after me. Quarter after, half past. Quarter till o'clock, quarter after, half past, quarter till o'clock. Okay, why don't you try to find quarter after one? Quarter after one. So it's the quarter of the way after one. Divide that clock into quarters. So if it's quarter after one, our Little hour hand would be, it says it's after the one, so we put it just after our one on the clock. And our big minute hand is moving. So when we do quarter after, it's gonna go down to the three. So there's quarter after one. So keep practicing. Try with a clock in your house or the printable clock Mrs. Mask will provide you. See you soon.